1985, you started work on Moonlighting. Yes. And I think your first episode was the famous black and white episode, the dream sequence always rings twice. Yes. So tell us about working on that. Well, it was really interesting because, um, you know, Sybil Shepard really lends herself well to a 40s um, look. Uh, And uh, I got along with her really well. I really enjoyed her. I liked her very much. Did you have much interaction with Glenn Gordon Karen, and did he have a lot of input? Um, he had a lot of input. Mm-hmm. He he was um, mm, he had an interesting relationship with Sybil. It was a it was kind of a love hate relationship, so there was always a lot of kind of tension around that. He was a creative guy, um, but I, I didn't have that much. Um, I mean, she always controlled you know whatever I did. She would say, she never, whatever I decided to do with her hair was fine with her. She never looked at it. Uh, but she never let anyone tell her how her, her hair or her makeup or anything should look from anybody else. So she dressed the way she wanted to and she wore her hair the way we did it. And uh, she never let anybody say she should have it any other way, mm-hmm. which was kind of nice. There was a big sort of scandal about. Um, um, about her and um, there people were she was getting a lot of bad press this is Sybil Sybil and uh, they it was around Christmas time and somebody leaked it into the press that she gave terrible presents or didn't give people presents or something like that and they had called TV Guide I think and said that she gave me she did give me a book. She gave me a used book. And it was about, it was called The Politics of Women. And um, uh, she she did give me the book. But to this day, I don't know if it was used and I don't don't really care. And and they they called me up and they wanted to, they wanted to interview me about her and her attitude and, and the fact that she may have given me a used book. And I just thought that was just the most horrible thing. And I said, she gave me a book for Christmas. As far as I know, it's not used, and I don't know what this is all about. And so then they didn't call me back anymore. I, didn't, I really didn't like that. Mm-hmm. Um, she had her moments. She was really angry with me when I left. I left to do Captain EO. Uh, and um, she was really, really mad at me for that and didn't speak to me for a long time. She did not want us to go and be anywhere else. She was, we would have to hang out in her trailer and be, we were her, you know, we were her friends and we had to be there and I guess that's why she was so mad when I left. But, have to move on and up.